Yeah, thank you very much. It's my pleasure to be here. This is my second time and I'll be speaking about optimal management of atrial fibrillation. This is the most common sustained cardiac arrhythmia in adults in clinical practice and it's associated with significant morbidity and even mortality. So it's crucial to optimize management of patients with atrial fibrillation. They are not homogeneous. They have different individual risk profiles so it's very important to assess each and every patient and to provide optimal treatment to avoid strokes to avoid heart failure to avoid hospitalizations and of course to reduce mortality and uh, what about the criteria uh, what are you thinking to choose the patients the correct patients to have this um, which is very important is to assess patient stroke risk that comes first that's essential to optimal management so patients who do have stroke risk factors they should be treated oral, with oral anticoagulant therapy and uh, it's a uh, in most of patients, it's a lifelong treatment. So patients um, have to, uh, to be regularly followed clinically. They have to be rechecked. And uh, nowadays, when we have several uh, oral anticoagulant agents, uh, we can adjust, we can uh, choose optimal treatment for each individual patient. So um, we can adjust drug to patient and patients a drug and only that guarantees a safe and effective treatment on a long term basis.